Yo, we missed like episode five just dropped and we will be continuing the Mugen train arc. Now in the last episode, Tanjiro almost took out Inmu, but then he Fight. merged with the damn train, which I feel like that was an ass pull on the villain side. At least in season one, I don't recall demons being able to merge with things. Like I feel like that's really important if they can do that. I just wanted to recap a little bit. Also, Inosuke is awake. So this episode should be interesting and it's also titled Move Forward. With that being said, I'm excited to watch this episode and see the beautiful animation. Let the reaction commence. Man, last time Tanjiro was this angry was when he saw Michael Jackson. Muzan, there we go. I mean, we already seen all of this, but it's still very weird. The boar. <laughs> Damn minions. Inosuke-sama. That's crazy. In the English dub, you know, case voiced by Aaron, the person that plays Aaron in the English dub of Attack on Titan. So that's pretty interesting. And Kirito from Sword Art Online. Don't ask how I know that. Oh my God, this is weird. <laughs> he does not like the train. To fall onto your knees. And the worst, bro. <laughs> He really believes in his own hype, man. That was clean. I'm an adult, man. It's not supposed to be funny. <laughs> I wonder what Enmu was before he became a demon. Cause he talks with like special etiquette. Maybe that's just his character design and they just didn't really consider what he was like before. But it would make sense if he was like from some noble family. Or was guarding a noble family. Dear God. Nezuko's tough though. I hope she gets incredibly stronger as the series goes on. Not just Tanjiro. Yeah. That's my goat. He's gonna protect Nezuko at all costs. Good God. <laughs> Come on, bro, that's your homie. Yeah, you gotta recognize that. Is Rengoku faster than Zenitsu? Probably not, but he's definitely com comparable. What an ugly mess. Because I watched the English dub. <laughs> if only I could crawl under a rock. Bro made the train jump. He gave the train a 40 inch vertical. The yellow boy. Yeah. He might be quicker than Zenitsu. At least right now, Zenitsu. <laughs> the goggle eyes. <laughs> that would make sense. A fight that takes place 100% on a train. That's supposed to be really difficult for samurai or swordsmen. I have to protect everyone. Yikes.
<laughs> Incredibly gross. Ouch. The first time Inmu felt pain, huh? Oh yeah, the conductor sucks. Of course he's gonna have the most defense around his neck. Oh, that's weird. Great thinking. Ouch. <laughs> what a goat. Lame deaths. Oh my god. Man. I just realized, if it wasn't for this guy stabbing him... Okay, nah. Because they said Tanjiro couldn't have been able to do anything against Akaza. But at least he wouldn't have been injured, you know? He could have did something. I'm sure. Nah, this is one of the cooler duos. Doesn't this look a lot like if you guys have seen Jujutsu Kaisen when Hanami was fighting Itadori and the best friend? Damn it, that's my favorite character and I forgot his name. I forget everybody's name, but it looks a lot like that when they were running around. Yes, sir. Slice and dice. He's using the breathing. Did he know Kami Kagura? That is so damn cool. GG's. He did that in an instant. Yo. Nah. That's how it ends? Okay. I've also been missing stuff at the end, so let me not do that this time. Is this from the dream? <laughs> oh, this must have been one of the... Oh my god. <laughs> I should have watched these before. <laughs> oh my god, that's creepy. <laughs> oh yep i mean next episode we're there i think the whole episode is going to consist of that one fight too because this is right at the end where ringoku kind of helping tanjiro breathe to control his internal wounds and directly after that we see yakuza with the amazing ost so again since i've seen these i haven't really had much to say but it still is a delight to see them and refresh my mind and i definitely gotta watch more of the after credit scenes of the episodes can't believe i missed those other ones before but demon slayer is amazing episode seven and eight are around the corner so we're getting very close to the red light district and ultimately seeing that one hashira who in my opinion has one of the 
with cooler designs and uses the word flamboyant a little too much. Almost as much as I use like hell or as hell. But yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys did enjoy. Thank you for watching. I am Christian and I'm out of here. Later.